What's going on, guys? It's Sepp, and first you can find me live at twitch.tv slash Sepp every single night at 6 p.m. PST. And today we are going to go over why you need to be running a chaperone. Let me uh, show you a couple clips. This is regular. I'm not getting Roadborn. Roadborn's an extra two meters. Oh my god. <laughs> what? That peak like right here and right here. If you put a rift right here, you can kill that. <laughs> no shot. Wait, just go there. I need to see that. Can you go jump on step right now? So yeah, as you see, it's uh, a little bit ridiculous. Uh, definitely going to recommend that everybody uses it in their slot because it is absolutely mad. Uh, I don't think a lot of people know about the Luna Factions trick where you can literally double your range with an empowering rift. But if you, uh, if you would like to give that a go, it's amazing for trials and it is ridiculous. You have a 13 meter base range on Chaperone, 26 meter with empowering rift Luna Faction and Roadborne adds one meter to the base, making it 14, and two to the Empowering Rift, making it 28. You guys absolutely need to be using Chaperone because, uh, yeah, once it gets nerfed, it's gone. And right now, it is obliterating shotguns out there. Today, I'm going to be using it with Spectral Blades because that'll be giving us wall hacks, and it's a little bit of fun loadout to use it with. I'll be using Shires, but you also have Palindrone you can use it with. What makes Chaperone so insanely strong is the range, consistency, and the fact that it has Roadborne. Roadborne is gonna make it so that when you have precision kills, it's gonna increase your handling, range, and precision damage. The range is not as much as it used to be, but it's still significant. And the precision damage makes it so you can obliterate supers with ease. It is super fun to mess around with. So let me go ahead and hop into a couple of games and uh, I'll see what I can show you guys. All right, looks like we found our game. It's on Fortress. Okay. This is silly. Okay, we cleaned up the melee. Ooh, a little bit of lag. Tough. Let's go ahead and get this kill. We'll probably end up going down. Try anyways. We are trapped. Gonna go back here. You two are either gonna have to fight or push me. Those are your options. I will wait. Looks like we got Merv. No! Don't do it, Lucky Killer 21. There's so much to live for. It is true, Merv is the only other player in this lobby. I think I've gone against him six times. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> sure, man. Well... Glad we got our Wii ran. Um, I'm not going to go ahead. I'll show a couple little bits of that, but that was not a gameplay that we're going to keep in because, yeah, getting a 20 and 0 on Fortress with this loadout is pretty cool, but we got like one chaperone kill and that proves nothing. So I'll get you guys another. All right. Hopefully rating close is a little bit better. Do have a different lobby this time. It's a shame going 20 and zero and uh, not being able to use it because nobody was close. Loadout, incredible, but everyone uh, is a billion miles away. Sometimes you don't get to use chaperone. <gasps> I missed. So the one thing about chaperone is that it is very forgiving, but you're gonna have to shoot people in the chest or a little bit higher and it'll count as a headshot. And I, Almost never used slugs before this, but all of last weekend I was using chaperone and uh, it is, it is effective. <laughs> Don't want to be a shoddy crutch, but I want to show off the gun, so we're going to do a bit of both. Oh, 
Looks like we had a body shot. They're easy to clean up. Oh, man. It is such a crispy shotgun. Extremely forgiving and very fun. Let's go ahead and reposition. You know, let's go ahead and demo the, the nice little scumbag spot. We like to showcase it when we can, right? Challenge me, come back. Let me show you that I do care. This guy jumps corner, he can get bodied. Perfect. The nice thing about Spectral is it's going to show us where everyone is. That Roadborne is crazy. Makes it feel so snappy. Steal the kill. Dang, just slightly out of range. Looks like this is a pretty good lobby. I feel like I'm getting kills pretty fast. Let's go ahead and pick up heavy. We are that guy. Making me look silly. I don't know what it is about me and not being able to predict players' movements when they walk. Sprinting or sliding, those are your options. Oh, I didn't even see you fly in. The chaperone is definitely doing most of the work this game. Oh my goodness. It is so crispy. I love it. I have Roadborn. Going to go ahead and push up with it. Hands me kills. Dang. If we didn't get shot in the back right there, we absolutely would have been able to take him out. That would have been nice. I'm going to go ahead and pop super just because I want to be able to, uh, to win the game as well. Nah, we combo those. I don't think that... I don't think that was even going for me. I think that went for the guy underneath me and I just ended up sli uh, slicing into it. Dang. That guy's running away. Go ahead and go back to competing over here. Perfect. It just hands us the kill. Didn't even see him. Didn't even have to see him. Perfect. Oh my goodness. I this this is a staple. A true staple in my loadout now. The chaperone is just just chef's kiss. I I am going to be using this every weekend though. This is actually getting me off dire. Last weekend I used Chaperone and Palindrome and Chaperone and Darkest before and uh, I think this might be uh, my dire promise killer. It might be, depending on the map. If it's a really short range map, Sudden Death might still be it. But if you guys don't already, please do give Chaperone a shot. And uh, as you saw at the beginning, the range on it is insane. The precision kills, they combo perfectly with uh, spectral blades because it gives you the way of the wraith it's good with luna faction it's it's great with titan because you have titan barricades you can shoulder peek with chaperone is a little bit busted right now especially since shotguns cannot compete with it so if you're having a little bit of problem beating the uh the mid-range fusion rifles pulse rifles you can go ahead and slap on a chaperone and use different uh, loadouts to work around it highly recommend you guys get used to it because it is definitely the new way, and I wouldn't be surprised to see it change soon. Appreciate you guys. Much love. Have a great day.